Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing the Winmore Special Edition Daryl Gurney Darts and these are from the Winmore 2019 range and these are similar to the other Gurney Darts but they've got a different grip and also in two different colours and this has got the compound grip and the black and green uh, cotton and this is a 90% tungsten dart and these are the 24 gram version you can also get them in 22 grams and these retail for £41.99 so let's check them out so the darts come in this nice green and black packaging can't go wrong with green <laughs> yes it's my favourite colour didn't I mention that before <laughs> inside you've got this form insert and that's uh, fitted into the Winmore little round plastic and aluminium point protector and very good looking darts and you've got the prism force medium sized stems and a set of the prism alpha standard shape flights so the darts are fitted with the free floor points with the finger grip and suits this uh, barrel with that design and also a very nice transition from the point to the nose of the barrel and it's the same kind of shape as the other gurney darts it's got your tapered front section but obviously it's got the three sections of the compound grip and also it's got the two cartons, the black and the green PVD cartons and it's got quite a wide smooth section there and one there but I think for most people you'll still find a position to get some grip off that but it's a very thin ring grip with these fairly wide notches cut through it um, just trying to get see if you can see that You'll be able to see it there. It has a slight uh, bit hard to get into focus there, but it's got a slight hexagonal feel as you roll it into your fingers. Obviously, because of the way the notches are cut, you might be able to see it a bit better there. But quite a good grip that. Um, it's probably high medium verging onto high level may feel different when I come to throw it but for front grippers there's plenty of grip there for middle grippers you're still getting some of the grip and depending on where you grip it on the rear if you like to grip right at the end you're getting a little bit again but probably less grippy for very rear grippers and maybe that grip isn't quite in the middle for middle grippers but you may just get a little bit at the end of it and there's your prism for stems and these very nice uh, prism alpha flights the black and green certainly stands out with that white Got a nice look in them The darts are fitted with the free floor 30mm point, there's a smooth section on the front of the barrel of 2.4mm and then the front section of the compound grip has got the black cotton and that's 21mm wide and then you've got a smooth band of 3.5mm and after that you've got a section of compound grip which has got the green cotton that's 9.3mm and then you've got a wide smooth section of 7.7mm and then a small section of compound grip again with green cotton of 5.2mm and then a small section on the end of 1.7mm length is 50.8mm width is 6.7mm twenty three point nine six grams twenty three point nine eight grams and 
23.99 grams and the full setup is 25.74 grams with nothing attached the balance is a little front of center and with the supplied setup it moves a little behind the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights just down to the grip um, it's got a slightly hexagonal feel but because of the notches that are cut through the rings um, if you catch the notch a little bit too much then I think that just imparts a bit of spin on the dart it just to uh, get the hang of the dart really get the feel of the grip but, um, from what I remember I think gold version were flying a little bit smoother these are a little bit shorter than the gold version so I don't know if you get on with a long barrel but I'm sure the gold ones were flying a little bit smoother I'll have to double check on the, the review of them but these are not flying too bad uh, so I'm trying the middle section now so I'm kind of where that smooth band is so Getting a little bit of grip either side, but it's mostly on that smooth band. Still getting a fair bit of spin though. But it should suit any style of grip, but I guess it just depends on where you, your fingers land and whether you're getting enough of the grip that you need. Balance wise, probably just a little bit better in the middle, but it wasn't too bad from the front. Definitely flying better for me from the front though. So I'll try the rear section now. Now that's got quite a wide band there, so I think for most people, if you're going to grip just above centre on the green section you might be fine but if you're on that wide band you're not getting as much grip at all there just a little bit from the grip behind that you can't believe it <laughs> that last start there was actually quite smooth like I said it, it could probably suit any style of grip but it's got two sections of smooth there so God, I don't believe it, I've got another treble with the rear grip my ears gone funny you get that like whistling sound in your ears sometimes <laughs> It's flying smoothest from the rear though. But not as grippy there. So that's the Widmore Special Edition Darrell Gurney darts, 24 gram. Um, 
it kind of reminds me a bit like the uh, old Barney style of shape but the grip is quite similar to the ones that were on the uh, Snakebite Mamba but it's a nice feeling grip um, fairly grippy but it's not uh, a sticky kind of grip um, just has a slightly hexagonal feel like I said which may be a little bit unusual to some people but once you get uh, thrown it for a while you just kind of forget that then it kind of just feels more like a, a grippy ring grip version but like I said it's got uh, two smooth sections there one's wider than the other so it will depend exactly where you're going to grip it but should be fine for front grippers because you've got plenty of grip there and maybe if you're just gripping above centre then you're going to be fine there but actually flew quite smooth from that rear section but I was mostly on the smooth part there so it's a nice dart, nice looking dart um, I think the gold version probably flew a little bit better for me through the air which was kind of surprising because they were a little bit longer than these but uh, I do like these because they're a, a nice green colour and like I said, I particularly like them flights as well. Very nice, sporty looking flights. So that's the end of the review. Thanks for watching. <laughs>